was going this hey. the power hey, hey. Jesus was going this hey. the healer hey, hey. Jesus was going this hey. the liberal hey, hey. Jesus was going this hey. the power hey, hey. Jesus was going this hey. the healer hey, hey. Jesus was going this hey. the power hey, hey. Jesus was going this hey. Jehovah hey, hey. Jehovah hey. Jehovah Jireh hey, hey. Jehovah Jehovah Nisi, hey, hey. Jehovah, go to your Lord, hey, hey. hey. And I'm a daughter of the house. My test, I have two testimonies. And they go as follows. On the 19th of December, I was working at the house. On the 19th of December, last year, I was coming from the room going to the kitchen. And I missed a step and I, and I fell. When I fell, I, di, I took it lightly because I fell before and nothing, I was better the follow, a, a few hours after or the following day. And I was better the following day. But Unfortunately, when I woke up, I woke up with a swollen feet and I was unable to step on the ground. And my mother immediately rushed me to the hospital and they took an x-ray of my feet. When they took an x-ray, they found out that uh, I fractured my feet, the side of my feet. And I was immediately placed in a cast which was supposed to last from the 19th of December to the 22nd of January. I came to church for the Tuesday service and I was prayed for by one of the sons and after I was prayed for I felt uh, my feet felt very light during the fracture, there were so many things I was unable to do. And for example, it was very difficult for me to shower. It was difficult for me to, to help out in the house. And it affected me negatively. But after I got prayed for, I started walking without my crutches. And I got the cast off three weeks, two, two weeks before I was supposed to get it off. Meaning I got it off on the 26th of December. Uh, I have pictures here on my phone. There, after the prayer, we can see that she, she was able to walk without the aid of the crutches that she was prescribed by the doctor. 
Ka pena hano ea kulo ilo ea mbizido lo mamango. Hallelujah, your hand for Jesus. Panduli la esu somakem. Hallelujah. Amen. My second testimony is um, is healing. Ulupando kolo langelu tibali natango luli kombinga eve lukom. So last week, last week Sunday, oso nda hajako? No, actually, uh, on the 2nd of January, Mama after, ya, after the crossover, Mama vali, ayanuali, koni mano, I started experiencing nosebleeds. But those nosebleeds will only start from 12 a.m. to 3 a.m. Sometimes it wouldn't even be blood. It will just be blood clots coming out of my nose. And um, last week Sunday, I came for the water service. And I placed what I went on the messy land and I placed water into my bottle. On the ano pedule filong enda de handi turiramo ome amokan dini kangem. When I placed the water into my bottle, I felt the urge to vomit. Eshi ano da turiramo me amokan dini kangem. On dali ano ndu ditenda fan antiale kukunga. And I was prayed for by Apostle Mutsa. On dali ndiri kano akom Apostle Mutsa. After vomiting, I could feel a difference in my nose because my nose would usually be feeling stuffy and heavy. Since last week Sunday, to this Sunday, I did not experience any nose bleeds. Hallelujah. for Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. Your word of encouragement. My word of encouragement comes from the book of Ecclesiastes chapter 12 verse 1 which is for the youth which is for the youth and it says remember the Lord your creator in the days of your youth before the days of your trouble come 